bada boom. Mrs. McLeish likes things nice and orderly. Someone's coming. Hide. Get in the ball. 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 Gotcha. Hiya, sis. Niblet. Shh. You don't want Mrs. McLeish to hear us, do you? Oh, she won't mind. She's really nice and really fun and really fun and nice and. Hey, what are you guys doing here anyway? Ah, you know, just stopping by for your three-month checkup. Once a pound puppy, always a pound puppy. We're a full-service organization. Well, everything is great, 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 great. I'm the most luckiest dog ever, and Agatha's the most bestest human a puppy could ever have. And we belong. And here she comes now. Statue time. Well, there you are. Oh, my sweet little bundle of joy. Mommy loves you so much. And she has a surprise for you, too. Mommy's old friend is coming to tea, and she's bringing her doggy for you to play with. Won't that be fun? Madam, a Mrs. Mildred Abernathy has entered the gate. There she is. Come along, Rebound. Funny, I don't remember buying any big hairy dog sculptures. Mildred! Agatha! Oh. I love what you've done with the mansion. I love what you've done with your face. You look 20 years younger. I was being sarcastic. So was I. <laughs> oh. oh, heavens, you've got rats. Droll as always, Mildred. This is Rebound, the sweet little dog I've been telling you about. What an interesting creature. So where's this purebred you've been bragging about? I prefer to keep him off the lawn. We can't have him going to a dog show with grass stains on his paws, now can we? That's quite the, uh, hairdo. Oh, isn't it, though? I take him to my salon. Only the best for my best in show. Northminster Kennel Club Show, that is. Well, he certainly is a handsome fellow. Ah, uh, ah, uh, dear. We don't pet Sterling von Oxnard. It distracts him from his disciplined training. <laughs> That, on the other hand, is what happens when a dog has no training at all. Well, it just so happens... Madam, tea is served. Finally, some hospitality. So, wanna play, wanna play, wanna play? Sterling von Oxnard does not play. Sterling von Oxnard shows. So you're one of those fancy prance dogs, huh? And who are you? We're the Pound Puppies. Oh, yes, I've heard of you. Rescuing stray mutts and whatnot. I'm a Pound Puppy, too, and they're my friends, and I'm their friend, and now you're my friend, too. Want to see my yard? Come on, come on, come on! <sighs> the things I do in the name of decorum. I don't think I like that guy. I like that owner even less. Come on. Sterling's had quite a stellar career. I had to add another room just to hold his awards. Rebound would probably win awards, too, but I just haven't had her compete. That dog? <laughs> Don't make me laugh. See, you just run around like this, and then like this, and then like this some more. No, thank you. I see no purpose in that exercise. But it's fun, see? I'll even let you use my squeaky duck. <laughs> Great! When I hear that squeak, I just want to have fun, fun, fun! And Agatha likes it, too! She squeaks it at me, and I squeak it back! It's our special toy, because we're special friends! She's my person, and I'm her pup! You don't seem to understand the dog-human relationship very well, do you? What do you mean? Well, think of all the things your owner does for you. Feeds you, brushes you, walks you. Why do you suppose she does all that? Because she loves me? Wrong. Humans don't love you. They love what you do for them. I am a champion. I win ribbons and make my owner proud. But wouldn't Mildred love you even if you were just her pet? Hardly. The day I lose, watch out. Why do you think my previous owner sold me? Fourteen wins and then one unfortunate second place. But Agatha never asked me to... Nothing is free, child. She rescued you. You owe her. Sooner or later, you're going to have to prove yourself worthy, or she'll just move on to the next project. But that can't be true. If you don't believe me, come listen for yourself. And then my Sterling won his 47th medal. All oh, the pride was indescribable. 
Of course, you'll never have to worry about that. Not with that hyperactive retread or, or whatever her name is. That's it. I'm going to bite her. Calm command, Cooks. Calm command. Hyperactive? I take umbrage at that remark. Certainly, Rebound is a bit enthusiastic, but she's just a puppy. And as a puppy, she's every bit as well-behaved as any other dog you might meet. Hey, guys! Look what I found! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mildred, I'm so sorry. Yes, well, you can't teach breeding, can you? Oh, really? Well, I believe you can. In fact, I've entered Rebound in a dog show myself. Oh, really? When? Uh, this Saturday. Saturday. Well, then it must be the Northminster Dog Show. Sterling and I are entered as well. And, you know, we've won three years in a row. Well, perhaps this will be the first year you lose. Is that a challenge? I believe it is. Well, then, may the best dog win. The Northminster Kennel Show? That's brutal. Yeah, and you should see this Sterling character and his stick in the mud owner. Ah, oh, they're gonna humiliate my poor Seth. She's gonna be the laughing sock of the whole show. Well, that's the pageant game. What do you know about it? You kidding? I was a show dog myself back in the old country. My stage name was Trudel der Schnitzel von Wiener. Ah, the glory days. Incoming car! Hey, it's my Seth! Mother, what are you doing here? I need your help, Leonard. I've got a dog problem. A dog problem? Why come to me? Did they tell you? Did they tell you? I'm going to be in a dog show. Yeah, yeah, they told us. Sorry we couldn't stop them, sis. Stop them? Why would you do that? It's going to be great, and I'm going to win and get famous and get lots and lots and lots of ribbons, and everyone's going to call me best in show, whatever that means. Hey, kid, do you even know what a dog show is? Sure, it's a thing where you go, and uh, you show, and, uh, no, nope, not a clue. Well, then, follow us. You entered Rebound in a dog show? Yes, and now I've got to get her trained. But, Mother, you've been so happy with that little dog. Why would you want to go and change her? Because I've got to beat Mildred Abernathy, that's why. Mildred Abernathy? That woman always scared me. Well, she doesn't scare me, though heaven knows she's tried. Ever since we were children, she's always had to best me. Well, she's not going to best me this time. I am going to win that dog show. With that wacky little puppy of yours? I don't think so. Oh, really? Well, it just so happens. Happens, I have a secret weapon. Mr. Julius. Mr. Julius! Wow! Olaf, were you listening at my door again? Yes, sir. And I just heard the biggest news. Mr. Julius is coming. Who is Mr. Julius? Only the greatest dog trainer in human history. He's got a show on the Mammal Channel. I've got every one of his DVDs. He invented this. What? The dull, blank stare? No, oh, the gaze of command. Works every time. Oh, brother. And Mr. Julius is going to train rebound right here at your pound. What? Why? Because he says my house has bad training vibes. He wants to work somewhere with better canine karma. Well, that's here. Heck, the dog practically run this place. I mean, not really. Just, you know, in my head. This is the Northminster Dog Show. Note the precision, the control, the poise of each competitor. Boy, those guys are good. And this is your friend Sterling von Oxnard, the greatest dog show champion of the last three years. Oh, look at how he heals, how he sits, how he downs. Ah, it's poetry. But I can't do that. I mean, Sterling is perfect. He's not running or jumping or nothing. You can learn. You just have to stay focused. Focused, right. I'm focusing, I'm focusing, I'm focusing. Hey, you bouncy ball! Uh, when's that dog show again? Incoming car! And it's got celebrity written all over it. <laughs> Mr. Julius, it's you right here in our own palm. What an honor. Sit. This guy's good. I presume this is the pupil? Yes, this is my rebound. No, as of this moment, this is my rebound. Let's see how well she knows her basic command. Down. Roll over. Play dead. Maybe if you give her a little hamburger. No human food. This may be the most hopeless case I've ever encountered. But I thought you said you could train any dog. Madam, the dog is not what makes this a hopeless case. You are. Such conviction. Such insight. But, but why? I love Rebound. Yeah, she treats this dog better than she ever treated me. That's precisely the problem. Demonstrate your walking technique. Sure. Come here, Rebound. Walkie's time. Wrong. Watch me. 
This is how the dog is happiest, with discipline. Gee, we don't usually do walkies that way. From now on, this is the only way you do walkies. Now reward her. Good girl. Mommy's so... No petting! A nod of approval will suffice. But... Madam, let me share with you my number one training secret. A dog is not a friend. A dog is a four-legged employee who works for kibbles and an occasional chew toy. I don't know if I like that. Do you or do you not want to win the Northminster Dog Show? I do. Excellent. You are dismissed for the day. Come on, Rebound. Not the dog. She stays here. I'll not have my good work undone by your nightly treats and pettings. Hey, this is a pound, not a dog hotel. <laughs> Yes, master. The real training begins tomorrow. I'm a loser. A big, dumb loser. Come on, kid. Don't give up yet. But I can't do any of the stuff Mr. Julius wants me to. I can't even do walkies right. Look, you're not alone here, Rebound. You're a pound puppy. And we'll help you get through this. I mean, Strudel here's won more dog shows than that Mr. Julius ever has. Right, Strudel? Well, I never really won, but... You guys would do that for me? And show up Snooty Von Oxnard? It'd be our pleasure. Then it's settled. The humans can do their thing up there, but the real training will happen right here. Yippee! Did I mention that I never actually won? <laughs> Stand straight. Chin up. Tail out. We are a proud show dog. <laughs> My fee has just doubled. Stand straight, chin up, tail out. We are a proud show dog. I can't sing it! It's a start. That's right. That's right. Help! <laughs> Anybody want some peanut butter and kibble? I do, I do! Oh, oh, me too! <laughs> Enough! But he said peanut butter, and I love peanut butter, and if you want to win this contest, you must focus! I can't! My brain just keeps moving around and around and around! Then we must find a way to quiet your mind! But how? When I was competing, I used a little trick. I would think of my favorite thing, the thing I loved most, and I'd focus on that thing so hard, nothing could distract me. The thing I love most, huh? Gee, I don't know. My favorite thing is peanut butter. Ooh, peanut butter. Well, I like peanut butter, too. Maybe I can use that. Let's see. Peanut butter, peanut butter, peanut butter, set. Peanut butter, peanut butter, peanut butter, down. Peanut butter, peanut butter, peanut butter, roll over. My dog, I think she's got it. Peanut butter, peanut butter, peanut butter, heel. Wow, she's perfect. Yeah, I can't believe it. I mean, I knew it. The dog genius works in mysterious ways. That she does, Strudel. That she does. Enough with the compliments. We've got a dog show to win. Is this the place? Well, I can't read, but... I'd say yes. There they are! Stay! Wow, sis, you look fantastic-rific. Gee, thanks. You okay, kid? You seem a little down. It's Agatha. She's different now. We don't play anymore. That's because she's in competition mode, and you should be too. There's my protege. Now remember, present her as I showed you. Raybon, heal! Why, it's Mr. Julius. He's amazing. What's that dog with him? Up! Well done. Here's a treat. Now, off I go to see and be seen. Good luck, and try not to embarrass me, okay? Well, Rebound, I guess it's just... Oh, no talking to the dog, no talking to the dog. Well, well, well. If it isn't Agatha and her genuine Australian Rebound-o, <laughs> do you honestly think anyone's going to be fooled by your made-up breed? I've had her registered, Mildred, and it's all official. This year, the ribbon is ours. Oh, yeah? First, you have to get past Team Us. Ladies and gentlemen, let the Northminster Dog Show begin. Best seats in the house. And 
now, introducing a new breed, the Australian Rebounder. Hey, that looks pretty good. Another Mr. Julius creation. And now, our four finalists. Mario of Pugsman. The Duchess of Afghania. Sterling von Oxmar. And Rebound. There will be a short recess, and then our final round. I'm gonna say hi to my sis! Okay, but don't distract her. Where does one get a rebound, though, anyway? Such a performance! Way to go! Listen, Agatha, there's a reporter from Dog and Country who wants to talk to you. I mean me! I mean us! Oh, well, I suppose I can spare a moment. Stay! You're not fooling anyone, you know. You may be able to walk the walk and sit the sit, but you're not a champion. It's not in your blood. Well, Agatha seems to think I'm a champion. She's pretending, and you know it. Why else would she have made up that silly breed? She knows you're just a common pound puppy who was thrown out by one owner after another. Rebound? They should have called you reject instead. <laughs> your sis, you ready to... Hey, wait, the final round's about to start! <sighs> we do what we have to do to win. Okay, Rebound, ready to... Rebound? Final round, final round! I'm so nervous I could cry! <laughs> Guys, Rebound ran away! What? She's hiding under the stage and she won't come out! Rebound! Rebound, you in there? No! Good thing Brains isn't part of the competition. Hang on, kid, I'm coming to get you. Careful, Lucky, it's pretty tight. If I get stuck, pull my tail. Rebound? You okay? Sterling is right. I'm a reject, a loser. I don't deserve to be here. Listen, kid, you got more heart than any dog out there. Don't let anybody tell you different. I don't know. I can't even keep my mind quiet anymore. Watch. Peanut butter, peanut butter, peanut butter. All I can think about is how sad I am. You know, I've been thinking. Maybe you've been using the wrong favorite thing this whole time. What do you mean? Well, seriously. Is peanut butter the thing you love more than anything else in the world? What's really your favorite, favorite thing? Well... Wait a minute. I know what it is. That's my girl. Let's hear it for our reigning champion, Sterling Bolotsla. What a old team. And now for our final finalist, Rebound! Uh, I'm afraid I'm gonna have to forge... Ah, ah, ah. Forge ahead! Come, Rebound! Who'd you tell her, anyway? I think of her true favorite thing. Agatha, Agatha, Agatha. She's in the zone. Nothing can stop her now. <laughs> And the winner of the Northminster Dog Show is... Rebound! I don't really like dogs. Well, congratulations, Agatha. I have to admit, your dog did well for an amateur. Thanks, Mildred. I'll take that as a compliment. On the other hand, this one has no excuse.
I don't know what to do with him now. Perhaps he's over the hill. I, I suppose I could try doubling his training or cutting back on his treats. Maybe I should just put him up for sale. You know, Mildred, if the ribbon's so important to you, here, take it. <gasps> but you won this. Your dog is the champion. I don't need a ribbon to tell me my dog is a champion. She's much more than that. She's my friend, which is something I let this silly contest make me forget. It's not this ribbon I love. It's Rebo. And Mildred, if you're half as smart as I think you are, you'll realize that you need something to love, too. Oh? Now, come on, sweetie. We're done with these silly dog shows. Let's go home and have some fun. <laughs> <laughs> a friend? But a dog is an employee that works for Kibble and... Oh. Well, I suppose one pet couldn't hurt. Maybe just one more. Gee, you think my little sister's finally, I don't know, trained? Well, they say you can't teach an old dog new tricks, but a young one. Teach a young one either.